Oh, so serious. Right now. Eva, you ready for a weekend trip? Oh, oh no. Oh. oh, no. She's like, yeah, well, I want to leave now. Get out in the car. Get out in the car. I want to now. No. All right, who's ready? Who's ready? She's nice and grumpy. Nice and sleepy. But that's okay. We can sleep in the truck, right? Right. You ready? Let's go. Let's go. Did we pack the whole house? Yeah. Almost everything. <laughs> I don't... Does that get any better? I'm asking... <laughs> Just parents in general? Yeah. It's like we packed the whole back of the truck, the inside of the truck, and there's stuff on my lap probably. We're going for... Oh, and the baby! Yeah, that too. <laughs> We're going for Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Three days. And I really feel like we have everything. And we only have one kid. I don't know. Just a lot of stuff. She uses it all too. All right, y'all. So I'm wearing the same clothes that I was in yesterday. We're over at my parents, and got this little nugget hanging out with me. Yeah. <laughs> She's watching me clean some bottles and make more coffee. Um. So we're over at my parents' house, and we had intended on filming an update for y'all. Um, Matt wanted to sit down and chat about some things, the house specifically. We ended up getting here um, trying to put Eva to sleep. She wouldn't stay asleep and then she woke up on and off all night. So Matt's actually working at ACL, which is Austin City Limits. I don't, if any of you guys have been around for a couple years, y'all know that he goes every year. It's a big music festival in Austin and it's like the thing to do in Austin, but he works at it each year. and. Um, so he gets paid to go, which is pretty cool. He works at the food stand. Eva! She's, she's working on something special for me. But, um, so he works with the payment processing with all of the food stands. So he also gets free food, he gets paid to go, and usually he gets to watch a lot of the night shows, which are the bigger ones. So he enjoys it, it's just really long hours. So he left at about 6.30 this morning, and he'll probably get back around two tonight and he does that Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. So he works all day. Funny thing is, I'm staring outside at the weather. <laughs> My mom's cute little decorations. But it is about 45 degrees today and windy. There was some rain this morning. It is cold. Yesterday, it was 96 degrees. That's crazy. Uh, so we're supposed to have some pretty cool weather this weekend, obviously. Um, I don't think it's supposed to rain for the next two days, but it's nice that Matt gets to work in the cool versus it being 100 degrees like it was yesterday. So that's that's the benefit. <laughs> She's just staring at me like, what are you doing? Um, so yeah, we wanted to sit down and film an update, but it didn't happen. So I'm kind of updating y'all. There are some changes that are happening with the house. I'm gonna let Matt tell you all about it. Hoping, we're hoping to be able to move forward in the next week. It's It's been a long, long process. And most, most of the issue is just time. Matt doesn't have time. He doesn't have time to work on it. Um, any extra time that he does have, we try and spend it as a family, but between his work, the band, now working ACL, and family, and then possibly trying to, to do anything out like, you know, with friends. He just has no time to do what needs to be done. So we're working with our guy, we call him our guy, Eric, to figure that out. But I'm gonna let him update y'all on that. Um, it won't be in this video, but I just kind of wanted to show y'all some snippets of what we've been up to. She's still working. I have been filming, I'll start a vlog on a day and then the day just gets away from us. So I'm gonna insert some footage from, you know, the last couple weeks. Just random vlog stuff, family stuff, you know, various things. I know it's disheveled and out of order, but that is our life now. What can you do, you know? <laughs> There's nothing crazy exciting. I mean, it's, it's like everything is exciting because we're always busy. And this little girl, that little girl keeps us so busy. But it's incredible because she's changing every single day. Um, it's like she learns new things every week. And this week she has been sucking on her thumb, which is really, really cute. Last week she was screeching like a pterodactyl. 
She seems to have moved on from that this week. She's rolling over now. She's not sleeping anymore. <laughs> uh, what else is there? I don't know, she's just, she wants to, she actually wants to stand all the time. Um, she can't sit up on her own yet, but she wants to stand either way. She doesn't want to lay down anymore. She's pretty okay with the little rock and play here because she likes to watch everything that we're doing whenever we're over here. But yeah, she wants to stand. She wants to be on the move. She, you can tell that she wants to crawl whenever she's on her tummy. She loves tummy time. She's really, really good at holding her head up. She is talking and, you know, making all the little baby noises and baby talk. No, she's just she's absolutely incredible and as much as I've struggled you know with adjusting to motherhood and postpartum depression and things of that sort I just wouldn't change it for the world she's she's absolutely incredible and I guess while we're on the subject um, the last couple weeks have been tremendously better tremendously better and I haven't been able to sit down and say thank y'all for all of your love and support and you know just kind of words of, of kindness and advice a lot of y'all had opened up about your own journeys or y'all had loved ones that struggled with it. One thing that has helped me a lot has been getting out. And I think that's the biggest mistake that I've made so far has been staying cooped up by myself all day with her. And so I've been trying to get out more at least every day, whether that's the gym or whether I try to go to the store either by myself or whenever Matt gets home. But Matt's parents have been watching Eva for a couple hours each day, I'll take her over there, usually first thing in the morning whenever she's happy, after she's fed, usually after she poops. Um, I take her next door and they watch her and I either just go next door and just kind of hang out with myself. I clean, do all the things that I need to do. I've also been going to the gym and just getting out during the day has helped tremendously. Um, we went and hung out with some friends last weekend. We've been coming over to my parents and my parents will watch her and I'll go to the gym or I'll go to, you know, go to the store or something. I don't do really much else than go to the gym, but that has helped tremendously. I mean, it's like I, whenever I get that time for myself, I feel like a whole new person. So that's kind of an update there. I will be looking into possible options for therapy because I know that a lot of people um, have sang, sang the praises of, of going to therapy and not just for postpartum, but I think, you know, generally I having anxiety, I think it'll help a lot. So that's something I'm gonna look into as far as, you know, insurance and all that nonsense. But um, yeah, I think she's, I think she's about done. But I'm gonna insert some just random footage. Hopefully y'all guys, y'all guys, Hopefully y'all enjoy it. And um, next video, we wanna do a sit down and talk about the house. Matt can tell y'all about his work, about his job, about the band. There's just been a ton of things going on on that end that he wants to talk about. We just need, I just need to, we need to figure out time. Whether it's like little snippets here and there or if we just find a time to do a sit down and talk video. But that will be coming up next week. Uh, since I guess this will be going up Saturday, but yeah. Hope you guys are all doing well. I know it's been, we've been just like on and off as far as videos go, but that is what it is. I don't know. Life is good. Life is real good.
Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. It is 7 a.m. here in beautiful San Marcos, Texas. Um, the sun is just starting to come up. As y'all can see, I just got back from my morning workout. Uh, Matt and I are actually going to go to Houston this weekend. Matt and I and Eva, all of us are going to Houston this weekend. This is going to be our longest trip yet with Eva. It's not very, it's not very far, but it's the farthest for us yet. The farthest for us yet. So, so I think it's going to be a really fun weekend and it'll be interesting to see how Eva does on the drive. Uh, I'm going to go in. I'm, I'm wondering if Eva's awake. And then we got to pack and get going. Let's do this. <laughs> Look who's awake! Hey. <laughs> Good morning, Eva. Hi, Eva. hi, Eva. Good morning. Hello, Eva. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Hi. <laughs> Good morning. You ready for some adventures? Where'd you go, <laughs> Eva? Where'd you go? I'm gonna take a nap. Hi. Good morning, sweet girl. Morning. Is it a lot in the morning? What? You did a little face. She's telling what? me about her dreams. We, we were in it. <laughs> <laughs> That's new. That's new. It's gonna go on the back of the truck next. So we got this, we've had it for a while, jogging stroller from my sister. Um, but we really haven't used it yet because she's been she's been a little too small uh, to go in it. But now that she is kind of, Eva, we're over here. Eva, she's looking at me. Hi, hi. Now that we're, uh, we, now that she's, you know, holding her head up and everything. Why are you we can at me put like her in that? the stroller. So we're gonna take that with us. <laughs> and we're off. We are. Uh, that only took us like four hours to get ready. <laughs> no big deal. We're heading out. Eva is happy. Um, as of right now. <laughs> We'll see how the drive goes. It's only two and a half hours. That's it with no stops. So I'm guessing we're gonna take two stops at least, depending on her yeah. bathroom trips and mine. And so I'm guessing three, probably three, little over three hours, three and a half I'll hours. Say, I'll say five. Five to be <laughs> safe. <laughs> we are packed to the brim. We've got the the truck bed cover with a bunch of stuff back there, so that's really, really nice. Um, and I guess this vlog will be up before y'all see the truck bed cover video. So we got a truck bed cover. Ta-da! The last, what, two times that we've tried to leave the house? The last two. We get Eva all strapped in the car seat, and literally as we're backing out, yeah, she starts doing her little, yeah. <laughs> so, nothing so far. We'll see how long, uh, how long that lasts. Stop. Can't go by Bucky's without going in, right? I have trouble. <laughs> right, Eva? You ready to go to Bucky's? That's what you're doing, aren't you? All right, Eva's having a little snack. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. Uh, how was it in there? It was terrible. <laughs> so it's the smaller Bucky's, which Bucky's is a staple as far as gas stations go, I guess. Mm -hmm. So no, it was pretty terrible. I think we got some good snacks. 
Yeah. We yeah. got the beaver nuggets, which are. Yeah. I mean, I don't think they created them, but they definitely do them right. Yeah. It's like Sugar. a caramelized Cheeto. Real healthy, you know. Yeah. It is. But they're like these little, kind of like kettle corn, but in like a little nugget form. Yeah, it's kettle corn. It's real good. Every like it's you know you have that one piece in kettle corn that's always that good and like. Mm, Covered yes. in sugar. Literally every piece in that is that piece. Yeah, that's true. It's a good way to put it. Yeah. What do you think, Eva? Too many people? Too many people. She seemed to be entertained in yeah, there. Plenty, plenty for her to look at. Plenty for her to look at. But there were... There were so... Oh man, the camera's dying. <gasps> He's dying. There were so many people in there. And my head, in my head, I'm like, nobody oh my touch God. my baby. <laughs> nobody breathe on my baby. Yeah, nobody. breathe on my baby. So I kind of cleared the way for him. Uh-oh. Um, but yeah, now we have, what, another two hours? Yep. With that's some bad crazy. traffic ahead of us. So, so, we've already hit traffic a couple times, but that's I'm okay. I'm trying to get there before Friday rush hour, which, uh, we, yeah. It's coming up. This <laughs> is why I don't leave the house. Eva! <laughs> your headband! Oh no, Eva! Your headband! Eva! Eva! It's falling! He's like, fix it for me. What are you gonna do about it? Hey! hey. <laughs> Too high. Too high. <laughs> Something like great. Oh, roll them shoulders. Oh, <laughs> roll those. Uh -oh. oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Playing with fire. <laughs> <laughs> Oh gosh, the sun, the hat's in her face. Yeah. You're just gonna stick the whole way down. <laughs> 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 the hat. She doesn't even know what happened. There you go. Chubby leg. That chubby pale leg. Eva. <laughs> hmm. There she goes. Race. What are you, who are you racing? <laughs> you cannot beat me. <laughs>
you poop? Blair, where are you? Blair, she's pooping. <laughs> ah. That's just me giving up on life. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Oh no. Oh no. Nice. You ready? Oh no. <laughs> and she's Eva. Eva, are you ready for bedtime? You ready for bedtime? What's this foot doing? What's this foot doing? Look at that little foot. Look at that little foot. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> that bag got her.